Hello? Hi, Thomas? Yes. Hey there, it's it's Carol from the Reasonable Sanity Podcast. Oh, hi, how's it going? Hey, uh, did you forget about us? It's okay, everybody does. I, I'm sorry? Ryan's doing a, we're getting ready to go on the air right now if you're available to uh, get on the air with Ryan. Oh, yes, absolutely. Okay, great. Um, so I'm going to put you on hold for just a few seconds and you'll hear some silence and then he'll come on and he'll introduce you. Perfect. Yeah, no, absolutely. Okay, great. I mean, seriously, for the last time, I'm going to make the statement, and I'm not going to apologize for it. I do donate money to the forestry companies to for, for their defense fund, not their profit fund, the defense fund that, you know, helps fight off these, you know, people that try to stop them. So, I mean, they're trying to cause harm to a capitalist company. I, I don't know how you could have a different view on it, but anyways... Up next, we have a really good segment where you guys get to interact with us once again. Um, we're going to have a, a tarot card reader on with us. Um, so we will be right back. And we are back. Reasonable Sanity Podcast. I'm Ryan Token. And with us right now is Thomas R. Brooks. Welcome, Thomas. Hi, how's it going? It is going really good. So I hear you do tarot card readings. Yes, sir. I've been doing them for about five years now. It kind of started out as a like rebellious hobby, and now I just can't seem to get away from it. <laughs> Yeah, no, you know, they, they, I, I hear you. That's that's how I am with everything paranormal. Anybody who is a Reasonable Sanity Podcast fan knows that Ryan is the guy to go to if you want your paranormal stories. I, I love it all, and 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 it and how would we know everything? That's why I I, I, I scoff at the skeptics of it. You know, just blah, you know. So, anyways, let's go ahead and. Uh, Take a call from one of our Patreon listeners. Uh, it looks like line four is open. Hi. Um, the Thomas, you said that you did this as like a way of rebelling. Uh, who were you rebelling against? Oh, yeah. No. So I grew up in a very uh, southern, very fundamentalist Christian household. Ooh. Where like even things like Dungeons and Dragons was like something satanic. And oh, so that. when I... Uh, Right? No, seriously. So when I got out of the house, I was like, you know what? It's time to explore. Like, it's time to figure out what's actually going on. So I started picking it up and working with it. And uh, yeah, no, it stuck. I really enjoyed it. Hmm. Did you use it? Did you try to, like, scare your enemies? <laughs> I haven't actually scared anyone. Um, the uh, should, Well, I mean, I do make should... people uneasy. Good, you should try uh, the, harder to scare them, make them go, ah! Uh, will do. Right. I will definitely put that on the list. Thanks. All right, all right. Thanks for the call. Um, uh, Once again, everybody, you are live. You can call in. I am talking to a tarot card reader named Thomas R. Brooks. He's been into tarot cards reading for a very long time, Um, and he seems like he's uh, really, really, really good at it. So let's go ahead and go to line three. Line three, you're on the air. What's your question for Thomas? Hi, what's this heathen's name, Thomas? Yeah, his name is Thomas I'm sorry? R. Brooks. Oh, yeah, yes. hi, Thomas. Um. I just wanted to read uh, something from our Bible to you that if a person turns to mediums and necromancers whoring after them, I will set my face against that person and I will cut him off from among its people, you heathen. Wow. Oh. Wow. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. I. I, I yeah I I mean I get I get both sides of that I'm I'm a real fence rider on most you issues know. and if you're a Bible believer yeah that looks bad but if you're not then it's not I fully Please. enjoy the Bible by the way I think it's a great text Why is Rachel even listening to this show She knows we have tarot readers on, on yeah here. yeah that's the thing yeah it, it, we don't usually do too much of the, the 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 Bible side of things but yeah all right um see it looks like line one Brad. Brad is on line one, it says. Brad, how are you? Hey, pretty good. I can't believe I got through. Hey. Uh, hey. Hi, Thomas. Hello. I just had a question. What you doing? What, I, I'm just chilling, you know, just hanging out on the couch. Cool. What, what you thinking about? I'm currently thinking about needing to do laundry, but I may consult the cards for that. That's nice. Okay. What you doing okay. tomorrow? Uh, I am moving, actually. Where are you moving to? Somewhere too far to drive, but short enough that I can't fly. 
That's nice. All right. Well, thank you, caller. You're welcome. Bye. Bye, hey. Thomas. Bye. Okay. Um, we are going to real quick go to a commercial, and then we will be back for uh, some more calls. We'll be right back. Beautiful. Pancho. Will you get up in the morning? Pancho. Will you make some coffee? Pancho. Will you feed your dog? Pancho. Will you answer your phone? Pancho. Will you go out that door? Pancho. Will you get into your car? Pancho. Will you go to that club? Pancho. Will you go to that booth again? Pancho. Now work that hall. Pancho. Take a loan for men who like other men, but only through a hole in a wall. Pancho. And we are back. This is Ryan Token with Reasonable Sanity Podcast, and we are on with Thomas R. Brooks, a tarot card reader. So, Thomas, are you ready to go back to the phones? Oh, I'm so ready. All right. Looks like we got one on. Line two, go ahead. Hey, Thomas, it's Dwight here. How are you? Doing well. How are you? I'm fantastic. I, I, I just had a question. How how long have you been a terrorist? Uh, I'm sorry? A, ter- a terror reader? I've been reading for about uh, 10 um, years now. Oh, okay. How long have you oh, have you been a terrorist for ten years? And and what religion do you uh, do you uh, abide yourself with? I do not abide by any particular religion. Okay, so like how is like have you been in jihad the whole time for the whole ten years, or just has it been shorter? Oh, I thought you were saying terror terrorist yeah terrorist uh no 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 sorry not affiliated were you were you affiliated with 9-11 okay i, I think I, the okay. uh i see what just happened here no i i it took me a minute not terrorist uh a, a tor, ter, tarot tarotist <laughs> like a, a person who used tarot cards tarotist you, you're saying terrorist like a a, a person like a, a al-qaeda type of thing no he's a he's no. a tarotist Wait, are, are you telling me that we're having Al Qaeda on the show now? I'm not comfortable no, with this, no. Ryan. The, the opposite. <laughs> the, the, no. Our guest is a he does tarot readings. He you just called him a terrorist. Not a terrorist, not a terrorist. So, all right. But I'm I'm fine with all the UFO people and and whatnot. But I, no, I got to no, draw no. the line somewhere. Yeah. No, Carol. We always appreciate you. Thank you. Um, looks like we got a caller on line five. Line five, yes. go ahead. Hello, oh, sorry. Where have you put my bathroom toaster? Oh, I'm sorry? Where have you put the bathroom toaster? Okay, D- did you hear? Did you hear that time? Uh, I did. I don't think I understand. Toaster. Do you know where the bathroom toaster is? I, I Can you can you do the card thing? Oh, uh, let's Maybe? see. I'm getting two of wands, so it could be anywhere. Uh, where did you last see it? It was in the bathroom. Um, in the bathroom? It shouldn't have been there. Oh, it, yes, it, it's it, a bathroom it, Did it wander in on its own? No, 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 no. It, it is her bathroom toaster. It, it, that's the one that's missing. Oh, shoot. Yes. We better go find it. Yes, I was trying to make the toast. It fell in. I don't know where they're now. Okay. Okay. Well, it sounds like it sounds like uh, Thomas can't help with that. I don't know. His cards can't find objects. I guess so. It will. It's a terrorist. No. Uh, uh, no. Not not a terrorist. A torrent ist. Yeah, terrorist. <laughs> okay. Well. Well. Uh, yes. Thank you for your call. Looks like we got another one on line one. Line one. Go ahead. Hey. It's 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 Brad. Am, am I on? Hey, Brad. Hey. Yeah. Hey, uh, so you're having t- a terrorist on today? No, a terrorist. D- listen, <laughs> I, I, I can't make this any more clear. Thomas R. Brooks is a tourist, not a terrorist. Thomas R. Brooks is a tourist. So, like, like nine eleven type stuff. No, like he can see the future by looking at a deck uh, of cards. Can I just ask my question? Yeah, go ahead. Hey, Thomas, it's cool to talk to you. Uh, hey, how's it going? Hey, pretty good. Um, were you sad when they killed Saddam Hussein? Uh, I 
No, no. I, I just mean being a terrorist. That, that's my, that that was my answer. That's about as good as that reading you did just a minute ago. Good job. Thanks for okay. taking my call. I appreciate yeah, it. Thanks for taking the call. Looks like looks like we got another one on line two. Line two, go ahead. Hey, Ryan. Hey. I don't appreciate you having no goddamn terrorists on this line here. It's, well, yeah. I mean, this, this show has done gone down goddamn hill. I'm about to pull my sport. You got some Al Qaeda, some bitch on here. It, it, okay, I, I think I think it was a bad idea to have a tourist on. Yeah, ter- yeah it's a bad right. idea having no goddamn terrorists idea, on here. It's not it's not Thomas R. Brooks's fault. He's it's just a, it's a terrorist and goddamn it, secure the southern border, got America. Yeah, an American tourist, not a terrorist. That's what he is. So, um. Yeah, it's, I I don't know, guys. I, this is this is I, I I'm just okay. We're gonna go line four. It looks like okay, line four. Go ahead. I I wanted to weigh in on the confusion with like the tarot the tarot it tarotists, and I think the word you were looking for is Tourette's. Oh, okay, <laughs> okay, yes. It sounds like there's a lot of Tourette's on the line. <laughs> Tom, Thomas R. Brooks is a Tourette's. Yes. Okay. Oh, there we All go. Right, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Well, um. I've had better shows. I mean, there's no way around it. We we mostly got caught up on hard words again. I mean, it's just something that seems to happen around here a lot. I mean, we all got his name right, so I think we should be proud of that. Also, if you want to listen to more of uh, Thomas R. Brooks stuff, he does he does a psych, uh, he does a podcast called Psychological Distancing with uh, a known terrorist, uh, Daniel Chadbourne. So if if you're interested in in, in learning more about terrorist stuff with them. Except for Chadbourne, he really is a terrorist and not a tourist. So, but if you want to listen to more stuff like that, feel free. So, uh, Thomas, it was great to have you on. Thank you for being on. Absolutely. Have a good afternoon. This has been Reasonable Sandy Podcast. Good night, everyone. <laughs>